Şey i̇zlemiştim. Arabaya helikopterden AR-15 ile ateş ediyor. Polis. Brezilya falan bu herhalde ya. Şuna bak ya. Evet evet bu Brezilya bunu izlemiştik. Bu çok güzel ya. Lan başka müasim insanlar geç. Oha. Polis arabaya kaçan arabaya ateş ediyor ya. Bu şekilde. Amerika'da bir Amerika'da yok bu kural yapamazsın bunu. Çok nadir mesela terörizm ya da çok manyak büyük bir olayda olur. Hayır burada olay ne bilmiyorum. Ateşin sesi kameradan dolayı arkadaşlar. Mikrofon bir seviyeye kadar alıyor ya. Adam artık akıllı oldu yani durdu. Boncuk değil ya gerçek silah arkadaşlar. Evet belki de vurulmuştur hiç bilmiyorum şahsen. Bakalım. Bu psikopat, bu manyak bir şey. Vurulması çok zor. Ya şansa vurulmuş, vurma ihtimali var. Şansa vurulma ihtimali çok yüksek. Polis isabet atıp bilerek vurması zor. Aynı fikirdeyim. Ama o mermilerden bir tanesinin şansa adama değmesi tamamıyla olanaklı bir şey yani bence. Acaba arabanın neresine vurmuş mermiler? Bak vurulmuş abi. Görüyor musun arkadaşlar? Ayağından vurulmuş. <gülüyor> Gördünüz mü? Geldim ya sağ rastgele şansa bir tanesi değmiş. Ha bu suatlı olan video. From getting back on the road and getting back into a chase scene here. And certainly, Gary, the hope is that this person will decide to pull over and stop and and and end this peacefully. And kind of went themselves so far, right? Okay, I'm giving you a tight shot here. I'll zoom in here a second, and you'll see that this person has a cell phone. He appears to be talking on his cell phone. He's looking out the window, possibly at us, at the attraction, and just weaving. We don't see anybody in either the front seat or the back seat. That one motorist and the and the police officer sort of following. Now we've got sound, so this is what people are hearing coming toward them, which would explain why so many folks were getting out of their cars to look because they could hear this. Car has been leading police on this chase. They've been on I-30 for at, for two hours. Here they are now in a residential part of Arlington. You see, he just turned left into some kind of, uh, we can assume, it's some kind of open parking lot. Mm -hmm. And uh, these, okay, this is the old TxDOT depot off of I-30. Um, and did you see him just pick up speed there yeah. and rush through? And again, this is still on a flat tire. That's what we see him doing right there on a flat tire. And he's driving okay. over the median here and back onto Collins. And around the traffic, some very dangerous maneuvers here as we continue to watch this driver flee police. So he is right at I-30 in Collins. Up until now, this chase has hasn't been that dramatic. He's been leading police, going maybe ten, maybe five miles per hour on the highway. But then, a short time ago, he gets off the highway. He's now in Arlington, and now he's driving erratically through city streets. We've seen him go through neighborhoods. He's going in and out, in between cars. He's whizzed by children walking on the sidewalk. He has no regard 
for uh, for any traffic. And there Park you Sunday, see him yeah. driving on the. This is just so you know where we are. This is the road to Six Flags that he's about to get on right now. So this is North Arlington. The Westbound toward Cooper. On the right hand side should be some kind of a golf course. Uh oh. Well, now he's moved off of the main road. So, so she knows about him, yeah. Very, mixed out. Uh, you can see where he's headed. I don't know what is through there. Looks like he's trying to get. Uh, this, this is an empty parking lot, a construction strip zone. Officers are moving in really soon. They really wanted to catch him inside there. But now uh, he's kolay, making his way back to the road. And and he actually, zarar vermeden. Uh, will probably get out of this um, Ha, bu aynı yer ama başka açıdan gösteriyor burayı. Evet, evet buradan sağ yapacak. It's really disappointing because it's traffic is picking up, the speed is picking up and uh he's southbound now on on that that would be southbound on Allah bilmiyorum Swat herhalde bunu. O Swat videosu buydu. Daha güvenli oluyor. Araba kurşun geçirmez. Uh, and on the right hand side of course all kinds of traffic but again this is the busiest tra this is the busiest area in terms of retail in ter for Arlington I think in North Arlington right Gary yeah it's very crowded here okay you'll see them cutting up across a sidewalk over a restaurant I I'm speaking just a little bit ahead here uh, but um, it is a very uh, very busy section of of town a lot of traffic not a lot of pedestrian Abi, traffic, bir sürü psikopat var Amerika'da arkadaşlar bir sürü psikopat var ya cutting across onto the streets Again, trying America to shorten his run, trying to lose these guys, but back out. Uh, now is going the wrong way down a street. Uh, this is just increased dramatically in danger. One way okay. down what appears to be this is the ramp to get on to get off That's on one of these uh -huh. streets here. Ters one gidiyor. Way, Ters yola gidiyor. He's going the wrong way, and uh, yeah, here comes a. Böyle bir şey yaşamak isterdim yazmış bir tanesi. Kötü adam olarak mı yoksa polis olarak mı? Suçlu ne bu adam acaba ya? SWAT'ın gelmesi ondan dolayı. Sağdaki SWAT aracı görüyor musun arkadaşlar sağdakini? Relatively quickly but after that will be 360 and then shortly after that will be I think uh, 161 if we're heading north on 161 but right now again on, on I-30 Adam direkt uh, dalacak bak. Headed on the he's headed to the east uh, headed toward the Grand Prairie right now. Şu an sadece well, herhalde uh, emri bekliyor. İzni him, bekliyor. Uh, this pursuit that's been going on now since uh, since about 145 that we have been following all of this. Evet, evet, SWAT ve polis özel uh, harekat uh, aynı şey. Afternoon, they've been following him. We initially heard that this was a simple traffic stop, but now we've learned based upon sources that Lawrence Akalik has uh, that this individual may have some extensive uh, involvement uh, with the justice system in terms of having gone to prison for, for, for drugs, may also be a suspect in terms of being a drug dealer right now. Uh, and is trying to elude police because of the situation uh, that he's experienced in the past. Tanya Eiser Ve bir sürü geçmişteki suçları varmış. Hapse hapse girip çıkan birisi. Yani sorunlu birisi. Evet girdik. İzin verildi. Take him out. Let's see what happens as he pushes to the right. Well, there we go. There's the bumper. Yep, they're getting him stopped. Bak bak bir de gelip. That was a, that was a SWAT There's vehicle. Movement, that's, Yeah, you see four work SWAT on the side. Açıyor. Lan lan kaçmaya çalış. Looks like a person trying to get out of the back right there. They call that a bearcat, apparently. Police officers coming out both sides of them. Oh, sorry. Police officers coming out both sides of him right now. Some smoke coming from the the, the white car of the suspect. Officers trying to come into the to the inside. Again, this trace has come to a close. Asking him to get out, and it looks like he either cannot or will not. You see them poking at the window. They'll be coming around to the other side uh, and momentarily. This is a SWAT unit that's come around that's pulled, that brought this to a close. Police officers again. There he is trying to crawl out the window right Aha. now. Police officers come Aha. around and grab him. Oh, silahla. Hepsi daldılar. Bringing him to the ground now. 
Officers look like they're securing the situation. They don't seem to be concerned about anyone else being inside. They brought the suspect out of the vehicle. It has wrecked. Uh, so it looks like the officers are okay. The suspect now in custody. Police officers securing the scene. Tanya uh, Iser joins me. Tanya, did you get a chance to see all that? You are looking at a pursuit taking place in the Inland Empire east of Los Angeles. Mark Los Conan Angeles is up ahead in Sky 5. Hey, Mark, can you tell us anything about this driver, how fast he's going, where he even is? Well, Courtney and Glenn, good afternoon. Yeah, yes, the pursuit was picked Los up Angeles by the LA County Sheriff's Department Los just a short while ago, maybe 20 to 30 minutes ago, out of the Walnut Station of the LA County Sheriff's Department here. They have basically made their way in towards LA County, and we are now southbound on the 605 freeway. In fact, uh, southbound on the 605 will just be coming on the Whittier Boulevard off-ramp. Now, what we have here is a silver forerunner that is occupied by, at the very least, two suspects wanted for burglary. Now, there may this be more. be a situation where he's going to have to slow down a little bit. There is a flatbed truck. Uh, about a hundred yards in front of him and he's closing in on it pretty fast. This is just a two-lane off-ramp, so let's see what he does. He's going to have to make that sweeper turn or make the quick right turn, and it looks like he's going to make the quick right turn here. This is uh, potentially not going to bode well for this guy. This is going to put him in a situation potentially where he may be stuck uh, by the fact atacak. that he's put himself into a neighborhood where there might not be an exit. So he is southbound on surface streets uh, and he's going to make a right-hand turn into what looks like a cul-de-sac and he's going to be off into the dirt here. He's going to be off into the dirt and he is going to be uh, making his way over towards the San Gabriel River riverbed. He is now just on the, east of the San Gabriel River riverbed and he's going to make a northbound turn. Look at this guy. He is basically off road and in the dirt because this is a Toyota 4Runner. This is uh, going to enable him to make these sorts of uh, moves a little bit uh, more readily and a little bit more easily. In fact, uh, none of the pursuing officers who are down on the ground uh, are, uh, are uh, you know, behind him. Bilerek araziye gidiyor, basıyor. By the LA County Sheriff's Department airship northbound on the uh, eastern bank of the uh, of the San Gabriel Riverbed, and now he is going to be kind of approaching uh, a situation where he well has uh, you know some room to some room to make a move here, guys. So we'll kind of see what he does. At least two suspects here wanted for the crime of uh, burglary, and again traveling on the San Gabriel Riverbed, the eastern bank, heading back northbound over towards Whittier Boulevard. We'll kind of follow this and keep an eye on it, guys. Araba manyak ha. Ha teker patlak mı arka tekerlek? Yok değil. Well I tell you what, uh, look where he is right now. That was one option for him to make a turn uh, and Oof. get back over to surface streets and he's uh, basically let that op uh, opportunity go. So he's going to be staying Oof. on the eastern bank here. His next opportunity to get out of this particular situation uh, might be over towards Whittier Boulevard here. He just missed an opportunity right there to get back on surface streets, but maybe that's going to bode well for the sheriff's department and the folks who are pursuing him because because he's in a relatively confined area that might allow resources to get ahead of him over yani towards Whittier yerde. Boulevard or the next exit up, which is going to be Beverly and uh, put them in a situation where they can anticipate uh, where his next move is going to be. So, again, he's just on the eastern bank of the San Gabriel Riverbed, and again, he's in a Toyota 4Runner, basically is off-road. Helikopter uh, on olmasaydı kaçma şansı vardı abi, çünkü baksana. He's about a quarter mile shy of Whittier Boulevard. Now, if he makes a move to the left, I don't know how he's going to get onto that uh, bike path, but that bike path does take him to uh, Whittier Boulevard here. Uh, just kind of looking at this, he might uh, be in a situation where he could be in a pickle here. He might not be able to get out of it uh, uh, with this Soldan vehicle. He might be uh, in a situation where he could be trapped. And there it is. Oof. His vehicle is basically stopped. Lan. Right there, we're going to see at least one person. The driver get out, and he's going to make his way over the fence, then into the uh, San Gabriel Riverbed. He's basically on the bike path, Gotcha. northbound, heading up towards Whittier Boulevard here now. No unit. Well, actually, yeah, we do have units up on Whittier Boulevard, so uh, they're going to be ahead of this guy if he makes his way over to Whittier Police Boulevard. Here, so, uh, they're going to be anticipating this guy uh, heading over in that direction. I do not see anyone else getting out of the vehicle, so uh, the information was that there was at least two people in the vehicle. So far, it looks like it's just one at this point, and he has made a turn into the San Gabriel Riverbed There's here. A lot so of activity here. This person is essentially still at large. We understand from a Sheriff's Air 7 overhead that they are now. Allah Allah kamera kesildi arkadaşlar helikopterdeki adam diyor ki polisler halen bu kişiyi arıyor şu anda köpeği bekliyorlar köpek abi kamera onlar görüyor da adamın nerede olduğunu onlar da mı kaybetti yok ya 
they're going to be bringing in robots uh, to possibly make entrance into that tunnel, whichever uh, seems to be the tunnel more logical option ha, at this tunnel. point. It seems to me the dogs might be a good option here, but uh, that is going to be up to the incident, incident commanders uh, to make that decision when the time comes here. But one burglary suspect still outstanding, believed to be in the tunnel system here in the San Gabriel River between Whittier Boulevard and Washington. Guys, tunnel that is the other from overhead in Sky 5 HD. I'll send it back to you. Up here. They are following up on leads, still looking for that pursuit Aynen suspect. Arıyorlarmış. Vay be, adamı bulamadılar herhalde abi. Tır. Bir de yüklü tır. This is McKinnish Park. Abi tırla polisten kaçılır mı ya? Aslında bir pit atsa durdurur ha bu tır değil mi arkadaşlar? Bir pit, pit manuvur yap. Bir de U dönüşü yapıyor. Abi. Ad, oha ya tırı nasıl dönderdi orada ya? <gülüyor> Şahane de işini biliyor adam. Adam daracık yerde koskoca tırı dönerdi. Bak bak bak. Korneye de basıyor insanlar için. Psikopat. Frenleri yanmış herhalde. Oha. Evet tekerlek patladı. Eridi yani. Şu olaya bak. Oha. Sedron ve Atheri Kaser bize abone ol. Teşekkürler. Bir dakika ya. Abi Amerika işte arkadaşlar. Al sana. Adam umurlarında değil ya adam kaçıyor polisler. Ne de olsa gittik diyor. Evet. Baya eski bir video ama. Yük düşmüş. I could just see one for sure. Yeah, news said it had been up to three, but we could just see him working on one right there. Ah, lan, lan, okul içinde çoluk çocuk var onların genelde. Sonunda durdu. Ah çıktı teslim oldu. Çok şükür ya.